morning. Welcome to Ordinary Days, where life with God is anything but ordinary. I'm Denise Larson Cooper. Over the weekend, my co-worker Lori woke up too sick to coach at the gymnastics competition. Who's she going to call? Well, she's not going to call Ghostbusters. I received the call at 4.45 a.m. After a brief discussion, I left for the meet. How did she know I would go? Well, for 20 years, day in and day out, Lori and I talk. We are always there for each other. We have developed that trust daily. Driving to the meet, the massive orange sun rose over the horizon, spilling light onto Route 176. The sunrise reminded me that faithful God always answers us. Our certainty in God comes from sharing our days with him. When Jesus walked on earth, he was always in communion with God. In fact, before raising Lazarus from the dead, he prayed, Father, I thank you that you have heard me. I knew that you always hear me. Through daily communication with the Father, Jesus could boldly declare those words of truth. Martha, Lazarus' sister, also knew Jesus trusted in God. She said, I know that even now God will give you whatever you ask. And Jesus tells us that God always hears us and responds. Hear his words in John 15, 7. If you remain in me and my words remain in you, ask whatever you wish and it will be given you. If you are not convinced God hears and responds to you, increase the time you spend with him and listen to his word. Let's pray. Lord, fill us with a desire to spend time with you each day in the scriptures. Amen. Thanks for listening. Have a great day.